Uh-oh. Oh. oh. <laughs> Whoopsie. Hello everyone and welcome. I am Slyfat Wombat and this is Fallout 3 stream number 9. You've breached our defenses, evaded our best soldiers, and you've raided my home. But I have not yet begun to fight. I cannot allow you to steal our freedom. The Declaration must remain here. It is our symbol of hope. The one thing that cries out, we are a free nation. Why, I am Button Quinnett, second signer of the Declaration of Independence and distinguished representative from Georgia. I know your fighting prowess far exceeds my own, but I will still duel you to the death if I must. What will it be then? Rapiers? Pistols at dawn? Out with it! This is no mere document, sir. This is the doctrine laid down by my fellow members of the Second Continental Congress. It absolves us of the tyranny of King George III of Great Britain. It is perhaps the greatest symbol of this free nation. Petty lies and deceit may be the way of Great Britain's crown, but I will not succumb to such tomfoolery. Since it appears you wish to resolve this without bloodshed, may I suggest you stand down and surrender? I can promise that you will be treated well, in a manner accustomed to any member of the Royal Army. Please explain, but I warn you, I am well versed on the tactics of the underhanded Redcoat spy. You do well to remember that. Saints alive! It is both an honor and a privilege, sir. I was hoping this day would arrive. I hope these fortifications are up to your high standards, sir. All of my men await your command to push and retake the capital. May I ask where you intend to bring the document? A new president? So the stars and stripes truly are forever. All hail the red, white, and blue. Does... does this mean the war is over? Have we won? It's over? Amen to that. Then I suppose my posting here at the fort is complete. I think you said it best when you said, We in America do not have government by the majority. We have government by the majority who participate. It has been both an honor and a privilege to serve in the army of the United States. What are your final orders? Coming from you, that means all the world to me. It's been an honor and a privilege to serve my country. It's time for me to take a long needed rest. I think you'll find that the rest of my men are long due for the same. I hereby relinquish command and control of this fortification to you. Good luck to you, Mr. Jefferson, and give Sally my regards. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that's it. Um... Oh. Okay, first of all, we're gonna go in here. Okay. Oh, yep. There we go. Declaration of Independence. There we go. Now, last time we did this, my entire... The game crashed my computer. I don't know how a game of this old crashes a computer brand new, but... I guess we learn something new every day. Oh, seems like we're good now. Okay.
now he can do it. to add the declaration to the society's collection. Oh my, I never expected anyone to find this. I didn't even know it was still intact. Well, certainly a reward is in order for your efforts. How about 100 caps? Thank you very much. Oh my lord, I never expected... I mean, I'm utterly shocked. You two have earned your places in the annals of American history. Yes, indeed. You will be remembered for this great day. I will award Sydney's promised bounty to her personally. No need to worry yourself about that. Enjoy your reward, my friend. You've earned it. What's up? Your schematic has been approved. Approved, nice. Okay. Ra Railway Rifle version 2. Nice. Don't mind me. I'm just taking up space here. Okay, so this is what we're going to do, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna do these. We're gonna look around all these areas. Well, there's quite a lot there, isn't there? Yeah, we're gonna walk walk around these areas. So we'll go to Fort Bannister. There we go. I found 
have the death core is is a lot. It's really fucking strong. So I might as well use it to kill these fucking assholes. Let's go north. I've been through Fort Benister and everything, so... And animals don't attack me, so... How do I get out of this? I do quick saves now. I found out the hotkey for quick saves, so. What is here? What is this? Another fucking bolt, is it?
want oh, I wonder if there's a way to have mods like um so what I mean is so these are the oh, well, hold on let me just do this stuff quick So these are the weapons I have. I got a lot. I would like, and, and if you press X, you can get mod mods. Maybe, maybe that's like you got to download the mod or something. I don't know, but good Hello. Contract for extermination. Your time is come. for extermination. Let's see what that's about. It's not here, is it? Oh. No, how are you being data? Find safe at one bat and show how we treat people that fail to live up to Mr. Tempe's expectations. Do not fail me. You know what will happen if you arouse my displeasure. B. B. I gotta say, having this deathclaw hand is fucking awesome. feeling that that wouldn't work like I wanted it to. What? Uh, this, this armor is so fucking weak, man. What it is, I may, maybe it's the mod I'm using. It's just, oh. Which is closest? Oh, okay. So that would be closest. Then we can go there, and then there. Okay. So we'll, we'll just quickly grab this.
god, how many fucking scorpions do you need? Poisoned me, so I'm just saying how long. Oh, we got okay. Wait, this is meant to be... There were super mutants here, but somehow the raiders over. Wait, what? Every, every, every single time I die. <laughs> Why is there a grenade every time? surprised that um wait is this <sighs> yeah so vault 87 apparently you have to like take mass amounts of Ma I don't know how to get into vault I was in vault 87 but I don't really know how to uh, un get out of the location so Oh, well, we're gonna go here. Which is another mutant area.
I'm pretty, yeah, I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure there's people in there that I have to rescue. So if I fat man them, then people die. This guy, this deaf claw gauntlet is so fucking OP. I'm here. Oh, how do you get in? Come on, help me. Okay, I'm um, okay. Shouldn't you be banging rocks together or something? Hey, local, shouldn't you be banging rocks together or something? Love to bang those two girls. <laughs> Sorry. Shellbridge. Shell. Your life is mine. What the fuck is Shellbridge? Wait, is it a settlement or something? Get me up. Oh, we got mutants. Okay, go. I am so in love with this fucking gun. Oh, this fucking death call. What the fuck is Shell Bridge? I thought 
thought that was an enemy. I thought Fox was an enemy for a second. Oh! If you're scared, if you don't like ants, don't watch this part. that these ants are from another ant colony. Perhaps attacking this rival colony would help the forager ant survive. Oh, okay. But what's the... Is that scorpion white? Oh, it is a white scorpion. What is it? An albino. Yeah, I remember that. Oh, fucking 
Oh, this scorpion's gonna kill me. Now's the time for blood. Oh, the scorpions. Actually, let's have the scorpion versing the robots. Now, Bino Scorpion is just a normal scorpion, but it's white and a lot more powerful. So, yeah. And this is the abandoned carport. Thank you, Rabbit Booty. Just fast travel. Let's just do that. North, north, that way. Enclave. All right, time to have some fun. one is still alive after a fucking mini nuke lands on him. Ah, oh, this game, man. This fucking game. 
Okay, so I'm doing this by myself because somehow Fox is nowhere to be seen. how that worked. It landed exactly fucking on him. My hand. Oh, there's my fingers. Okay. Now, does my apparel actually need any? Oh, it does. Okay. Kind of wish I had a perk that whenever you were radiated, you would start healing. That'd be a nice perk. I think we got some raiders here. Reflect off the mirror like finish of your climbing gleaming armor. You gain additional 5% damage, threshold against end your weapons while wearing plus 2% while wearing reflective eyewear. I like that one. So, laser beams are going to do less to me, in other words. Let's actually, let's, yeah, let's do this. Oh, well, actually, we'll do, we'll do spring valves. Oh, what? What's the enemy? Oh, 
crap! Oh. Okay. Okay. Good yow gal. Oh. I thought it was a yeah. I thought it was a death claw. I honestly thought it was a death claw. That's why I ran away. I didn't realize it wasn't it. It wasn't a death claw. All right, so where will Springvale? So we'll go to Springvale School, then we'll go up northwest. Okay, must you want to come back? Well, after you finish the main storyline, certain things start popping up. It must be, it must be when I come back or something, I don't remember. Anyways, we're gonna go to school and learn how to write the ABC. Not really. Oh my god, we got frame drops then, holy dick. I did hear a chainsaw, okay. Your life is mine! Okay. But this has been a bit difficult, I'm not going to deny that. Just, I think I think now it's becoming a little bit of a... something that's kind of fun, because I'm just going through and killing... I just... Oh, it's amazing how good this fucking death point is, holy shit. Must 
scared. I'm gonna tear you up. certain key. Maybe I could just cheat too. I've been doing that lately in these. It's probably up there actually. Oh, right. 
right, we had to go out here and kill these fuckers. Forgot about that, my bad. Mindful of what? Vault 106. We're gonna go there and then we'll do all this shit. doesn't do anything to tell it to robot.
doesn't do anything to robots. <laughs> it slices up fucking anything that's a, a human, but other than that, it can't do anything. That's great to know. Yeah, I'm not worried about the people up there. That's just, yeah, I'm not worried about them. You know what I love? The movement. Just, just sliding all the time wherever in this game. Okay, let's go to where I, where I was intentionally meant to go. Never knew the wasteland was this bright. I could find more. No, I'm not going to find mods. I've got two mods already in my game. Crashes with these mods, so I'm not going to try and push it.
There is reason to be cautious here. Are you serious, dude? Like, I've got a death claw hand. It's fucking awesome. You've got a Gatling laser that never runs out of ammo. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure we're okay. I'm like nearly 121% pretty sure that we're okay. Love it how I jump. song is now ah uh, that song is gonna make this copy written awesome thank you so much for that so okay hold up Ow! every fucking time La 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 I'm just singing over this fucking radio. Call the truck. Oh right, yeah, I don't. Six Vault One O. I think this is actually a quest. Oh well, it looks like we're going to Vault One O Six. Ah, oh, fuck. Well, the wasteland is dead. There's ten volts? No, that. Oh, wait. There's, there, there, there's ten volts in this game and the next game. Now, what was Vault 106 about? I forget what Vault 106 was about. Was it the cleaning facility? Or is that Vault 80? Vault 9. One or one six or
Sorry, <coughs> I had to sneeze. Now do 10% more damage to robots. You found a Vault Tech Limited Edition bobblehead. The description on the base is always be prepared to explain the hows and the whys. You now do 10% 10, 10 damage to robots. Nice. 10. I found 10 and I just lost major amounts of things. I don't get why. It's the mod. I got swear. It's gotta be the mod that makes me drop points. Okay. Oh. Fuck it. Mm, fuck it. Station has been checked in the So the overseer started killing people?
Healthy is ah, oh, it is a bit low. What was that? Don't bring me back. Oh! I didn't want to do that. Survivor. That's why they must have stopped building. But that's when the bombs dropped. Okay. Oh, wait. Isn't this the way to the living quarters? Yes. I don't think there's any way I can get to those people. Maybe. kind of where I wish I had like um, auto loot so I could just walk past this shot, this shot, this shit and pick it all up. Oh. Okay. 
don't think there was any other way, was there? Yeah, no. Oh well. Pretty sure there is a door somewhere, but I just can't really get it. There's nothing here, just... Uh... Uh, Shinobi Necro has said there was supposed to be a hallucination where you fight your friends from Vault 1 and 1, guess one of your mods interfered or something. Oh. Okay. Maybe it's at the end? from here didn't I? Yeah, I came from here. Yeah. Alright, well, oh well. that like in the future of games, I know this is probably really stupid, I uh, wish that we could tell our companions to move or something. Oh look, raiders. Probably like, why doesn't the dog attack? My god, talk about train jobs, how do we It's just so fucking OP. <laughs> okay, uh, where are we going? Uh, we'll go there and then, uh... We'll go west, this way, or this way. 
And then we'll go after Erifu. Which is... North? Up there, that's where Erifu is. Oh, it's an Alcar scene! Back off, Wogel. Back off, idiot. Ooh, what is this? Um, what if you could tell your companions to target a specific enemy or even a specific body part? That would be something that the Fezzer will never bring in, but that's a good idea. How about you just mind your own business, okay? Okay. Sorry, I didn't fully read that. Um. No, I didn't change the difficulty at all. I got this. This thing is so fucking insane. Plus, I've got a, a lot more perks and I've gotten a lot stronger too. And I've got different armor as well. That's my armor. No, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't change the difficulty. I've just been playing this a, long, a lot now and my strength and everything has gone up. My guns are more powerful, my weapons are more, are more powerful, my grenades are more powerful. A lot of me is more powerful now, so... That's a big coffee pot. That was a bomb going off or something. And we got BBs. Hearing things, eh? Oh, no, no, no. Folks, I need you to get down, mate. What the hell is Forks Gat Gatling all this time? Um, I don't know. Um, I think it's a bug in the system, or maybe it's just something in the in the mod. For some reason, the companions never run out of ammo. I love it. I'm really happy about it. I'm sad about that. Yeah, I don't know why Forks never has to run out 
I don't know, so I know I'm not complaining. So Okay, we're gonna fix you. There we go. Stronger now. Alright. So we're gonna go to Erifu. Now Erifu is an actual is a quest um I was joking. Oh. So I don't uh, the one thing with tap typing, and I really would like it if a lot more people would do it. If you're not being serious, just write LOL or JK behind it or sarcasm or something. Oh fuck. If anyone's in the army and you're watching this, I'm sorry. <laughs> You're not one of them. I nearly blasted you in two. Get over here before they spot you. Now what the hell are you doing all the way out here? I thought you were one of the family. They're some low-life gangers who've been giving us a hell of a lot of trouble lately. They're the reason for my itchy trigger finger. Well, at first they do their typical gang bullshit. You know, break stuff and make lots of noise. But they always kept their distance. But this last time, they went too far. They killed all of our Brahmin. I mean, that's our lifeblood out here, you know. Ah, look, you can call me crazy if you want. But there is something odd about those creeps. I mean, they got the guns and they got the muscle. Why don't they just bust down our doors and take us out already? We're really in a bad way, and could use some help. I don't want to take my eyes off the ramp here. There's no telling when the family will return. Can you do me a favor and check on the other people's houses here? You know, make sure they're doing okay? Speak with Davis West, Karen Shenzi, and Ken Ewers. Just watch yourself. I've got an itchy trigger finger. Yeah, I've got a mutant as a backup, so... Hello? Is this the mailman? Oh, I do hope my fall catalog has arrived. Oh, Evan, he's such a gentleman. Please, do come inside. Let me unlock the door for you. What the hell are you doing in here? Get the fuck out! Oh, for the love of... Look, she's dumber than a bag of hammers, okay? If you want to talk to anyone, you need to talk to me. So what the fuck do you want? We're great, just peachy. I love sitting in my house with my thumb up my ass. Tell Mr. King that sitting here all day isn't going to make us any safer. We need to take action. Yes. Who is it? Oh, he did? Well, it's about damn time he did something. Come on in. I'll unlock the door. It's nice to see a friendly new face around here. It's been a long time. The name's Karen Shenzi. Scared out of my mind! I'm glad he's checking on us, but until someone nips the problem in the bud, we may as well stay inside forever.
What did they tell you? Everyone okay? The family must have gotten to them in the last attack. Sons of bitches. Damn it! If only we had more men, we could stand up to them. I'm sick of them terrorizing this town. Wait a minute. When you searched the West's place, did you find their son Ian's body? This has to be the work of the family. I've caught that weirdo leader of theirs talking to Ian down by the river. Look, I know I've asked a lot of you already, but you have to find that kid. He deserves better than all this. Thanks, kid. You're all right. Bite marks on their necks. That's the strangest thing I've ever heard. The family must have attack dogs with them or something. Oh, this is all I needed right now. What am I going to do? They'll keep coming back until all of us are dead. I think they live somewhere east or northeast of here. Problem is, they always travel in the dark, so I can't see exactly where they go. There's all kinds of places they could be hiding, like Hamilton's Hideaway, the old Moonbeam Cinema, or Northwest Seneca Metro Station. I know where they are. I know exactly where they are. They're, they're fucking... they're there. I know. They're there. Okay, I don't know why my... I love how fast I lose my breath in this game. Look at that. I swam, what, 10 meters and had to come up for air? Come on. And I'm in a fucking suit. There we go. The builders have built the builders. The buildings have rendered a goddamn it. We've got Enclave. Fuck. Battlefield, the enemy, the fucking AI doesn't get. Oh shit.
I think the very first time I ever met the talent company, I was in that grocer. I walked out and they're like, oh, look, it's the saint of the wasteland. Let's attack him. They got all fucking destroyed, but that's not the point. Uh, we, we, we'll, we'll, we'll do all that later. We'll, before tomorrow's stream, I'll, um, I'll fix up all my weaponry and armor and shit. You're not... not here to try and steal my secrets, are you? Good. I was afraid I was going to have to abandon my lab here. That would mean starting all over again. It's not easy trying to make Ultra Jet, you know. I suppose you could say that. Ultra Jet is almost double the potency of Jet. Perfect for ghouls. Jet barely affects us, you see. Only trouble is, it's almost impossible to gather the ingredients together. Say, you might be able to help me with that. It takes three things to make Ultra Jet. Two of the ingredients I got plenty of. The other one is a little harder to find. Sugar bombs. I distill it down to its base contents and add that to the formula, then presto, Ultra Jet. For every box of sugar bombs you bring me, I'll pay you 15 caps. So, you in? Fine, anything to get what I need. Now scram, I got some preparing to do. But don't you want to- So, what did you bring me? Wait, are they past? Oh, they might actually be past the ghouls. Ah, here we go. There we go. Oh, no, not you fuckers. One thing I've noticed with this game, it is very finicky. Oh, there is a fucking entrance.
Yeah, okay, so I did go the wrong way. Oh, it was that thing. Okay. Why don't you look where you're going? Whoa, whoa. Slow down there. This area is off limits to everyone but the family. Where the hell do you think you're going? All right, all right. I guess you look harmless enough. If I were you, I'd speak to Vance before you poke around too much. You can usually find him on the mezzanine overlooking the common area. Just remember, I got my eyes on you. We all do. Yeah, yeah, dude. I look so... Welcome to our home. My people call me Vance. I lead this group of weary travelers and outcasts who need a home. And to what do I owe the pleasure of your visit? What you see before you is the last bastion of hope for the downtrodden and misunderstood. It is a sanctuary for the oppressed and a beacon of faith for the tyrannized. We are the remnants of society, cast aside like the clean-picked bones of a hunter's feast. I led my flock beneath the sun-baked sands of the wasteland to keep them safe and teach them my ways. Men of science would call us cannibals, eaters of human flesh. Society labels us as monsters, demons, and the unclean. You amaze me. Never have I met a human with the gift of cognition that you possess. Tell me then, what are we? Do you think I believe I can turn into a bat and fly away? Of course not. Do I cast my image in a mirror? Absolutely. Now ask me if I believe these individuals from every corner of the Wasteland need me to give them a sense of purpose and identity. I have shown these people the ways of the Vampire. I have provided them shelter, organization, and a sense of belonging. Yes, in a way I am brainwashing them. I am eliminating their fears, their inhibitions, and their shame. I have reigned in their cravings, and taught them to eat not of the flesh, but to drink of the blood. Most importantly, they have a family. A place where their quirks are tolerated and understood. There's a unique weapon in here if you want to. It's called Vampire's Edge. It's in Vance's room, maybe. Ah, yes. My newest charge. What would you want with him? We are his family. If he were to leave, how can you be certain he would not feel the same way about us? Ian is at a critical moment in his life right now. After all that occurred in Erafu, he is scared and confused. It would be ill-advised for me to allow you to speak to him while he decides what he wants to do. Ian's hunger for flesh overwhelmed him. It drove him to kill his parents. Fuck off. Because of my intervention that night, he stopped just short of being lost forever to his cravings for flesh. I am telling you, he will no longer be labeled as such. He has become one of us, a member of the family. The hunger that drives us must be kept in check. It is one of the most difficult things to teach. Ian lost control because no one was around to guide him. His own family was alien to him. No, it would not be right to disturb him in this time of meditation. I am sorry, but I cannot allow it. 
You wish to speak to me again? I had always assumed if a human happened upon our home, it would be for the purpose of our extermination. It appears my fears were ill-placed. It is a pleasant surprise to meet someone as amenable as yourself. Very well. I will allow you to speak to him. Perhaps you can help him come to grips with his greatest enemy, himself. Your Hello there, stranger. Uh, these people are fucking stupid. Uh, is it this one? What do you want? I guess I shouldn't be surprised. I'm sure Evan King is pretty pissed right about now. I bet he has the entire town out looking for me. She's worse than my parents. You think I don't know that? You think I don't know what I did? Then you must think I'm some kind of a monster. There's something inside me, something completely messed up. I'm a mutant, a fucking freak. The only person I was ever able to talk to was my sister Lucy, and she's gone. No one gives a shit about me except Vance and the family. Can't you understand that? You know, for a second there, you sounded just like Vance. And you're right. I don't know what I'm running away from, but given time, maybe things can go back to the way they used to be. Please tell Vance I've made my decision. I'm going home to Arfu. I hope to see you there as well. I'm just gonna gather my stuff together and say my goodbyes, then I'll head on back. Okay, so where is Vance's room? Honestly, I don't care. I, I, oh, it's, it's in there. Honestly, I don't really care. I, I know, I'm sorry, it's just, I'm not really a melee, oh, I should say I'm not a melee guy, I'm just... Where'd he go? Hey, dick face. I trust your talk with young Ian went well. I am quite interested in learning the results of your discussion. Did he come to a decision? As long as you maintain this level of civility, please proceed. Many years ago, I survived by drinking from fresh blood packs I recovered from hospital ruins. The problem was that these blood packs were scarce. What do you propose? Agreed. Please, take this proposal to Arafu. Speak with them and then return to me with their decision. I thank you for showing me that your kind can be trusted after all. It is a lesson I will not forget. Now, what of young Ian? Tell me his decision. It saddens me to lose one of my flock, but I believe everyone has to follow their own path. All I was attempting to do was guide him. Now it seems that responsibility has fallen upon you. I hope you will be more successful. Please, I want you to take this. Consider it as an apology to you for all the hardships you had to endure finding this place. Goodbye, human. Our time together has been rather educational. Hey there. You're a dickhead. Well, hey there, okay. Jerry. Look, I know this is The new guy's guy so taking up most of my time, but I think he'll come back. Is there a way? Yeah. Alright, that's fine. This is probably the part I hate so much about. Going back and forward just to tell them, oh, well, this is what he wants. Oh, this is what he wants. Oh, it's you again. 
What's up? Nothing, Jacob. Sorry. That's going to be the end of the stream, okay? Your life is mine! I know. I talked to Ian, and he told me everything you did. I don't know how you did it, but goddamn am I glad you walked up that ramp and lent us a hand. Thanks again, kid. Consider yourself welcome back here anytime you're in this part of the Waste. Interesting. It seems they wish to enter into some kind of agreement. I guess it's better than pointing my gun down that ramp all day and hiding inside at night. Let Vance know he's got a deal. We'll do it. I'll speak to the others. I'm sure they'll agree with me. I've been saving up stuff for emergencies, in case things with Arafu got tremendously bad. You're welcome to... Come on back. All right, now I've got to go talk to Ben. Is that one, was it? Yeah. Mer Merizzi. I this is the thing I... It's the one thing I kind of hate about Fallout. And Fallout 4 has it. You constantly have to go back and forth. You constantly have to go back and forth to talk to these people. Like, oh, well... You know, he wants this deal and he wants this. I kind of wish that it was just... Automatic a bit. It's a pleasure to receive you in Moresti. Moresti. What brings you down here today? Excellent. I knew you would serve as an ambassador for us in good faith. I will dispatch Alan to Arafu immediately to help serve as their guardian and honor my end of the agreement. Your efforts surpass those of the average human. In fact, I feel almost like you are a member of our flock. If you ever wish to learn our ways, you have but to ask. I'm certain our paths will cross again. Not on your fucking lifetime, mate. Dumbass. There are times that I think the primal part of me pulling me away. Jump. Jump.
right. Um. Uh, sorry. What do we have here? What are you? Company Mercs you want to send me game? They're all gonna die the fucking same. I don't know where Falls went. He like just ran off, like just piss bolted away. What do we got here? More Talon? Raiders? Raiders! I'm sorry. Did you know Bethesda? It's making for yeah. And yeah, I know Bethesda making a uh, TV show. I'm a little bit on the uh, I'm a little bit on the side of is it going to be good or is it going to be bad? That's all. Um, not saying like I really wonder where they're going to go. Like. Are they going to start Fallout in in the um in the very first Fallout, or is it going to start at Vault uh, Vault 101, where you know you're born and the first episode is life in the vault, and then you have to escape the vault, and then that's and then the second episode is going to Megaton, like I kind of did, you know. I'm I'm just more I think I'm more curious about how they're going to come about with making the game and what they're gonna have to cut out and what they're gonna oh, I could have given them hits of blood packs. You know, what they're gonna cut out and what they're not. Uh who's gonna play certain roles like uh, Hey, 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 wait, 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 wait. Patience. Fucking sorry, boy. Yeah, I'm just a little bit more curious about that. Yeah, because no matter what they do, no matter what they do, the ride is doing all that, no matter what, someone will bitch. Someone will be like, oh, that's not realistic. Oh, that's that shouldn't be in the game. There's always going to be that one person who's just going to be like, nah, I'm going to be negative towards it. I'm going to be, I'm going to be negative Nancy. I'm not going to say the that stupid Karen crap because I know someone called Karen, so... Hamilton Hideaway, where are you? Is it here? The air smells. Hey. There you are.
Oh look, I got all my health back. Oh my, I feel, I feel like my game is about to crash. So, if the game crashes, that's the end of the stream. I'm just gonna cancel the stream, I'm just gonna stop the stream straight away because my backgrounds are not... My backgrounds are not PG, my backgrounds are more of the uh, naked female body. So, someone might get offended if they watch this. And if you don't, then, well, you have a brain. I don't know why people get offended by seeing a naked lady. Like, seriously? Even gay guys like looking at naked ladies. Like, boobs are great. Anyways. Yes, I know they're making a, 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 a Fallout TV show. I'm just trying to figure out where they're going to go. Or what they're going to do with it. Fuck me! Fuck, fuck, fuck! I only they're fine. It's the other one. It's the big fucking white one that you need to worry about. It's that big fucking thing. Alright. Uh, do we have grenades? Oh, I shouldn't have done that one. Let's see. Yeah, I feel like my, uh, I feel like it's my thing. Where'd you go? Ow! I fucking heard. How is it that they fired into what's good against fucking I guess they are covered in fucking armor. the other This goes. Oh. Oh, okay, so we did full circle. Alright. God fucking ah 
these maps are fucking confusing. Sorry, I'm sorry too much. These maps are confusing. I guess we could, uh, we could do these ones. Far fa Fairfax. Yeah, we'll do those ones and then we'll uh, go from there. Wait, wait, hold on, wait, where am I going? Hello there, fella. Good to meet you. Name's Smith, Jack Smith. Welcome to Andale, the best little town in Virginia. Uh... Not here. Not in Andale. No, sir. The great commonwealth of Virginia is alive and well. In fact, we just voted ourselves a new governor. The adults walked right on down to the polling location and dropped ballots into the box. How do you think it works? Yes, sir, it's every American's civic duty to cast his vote for his favorite Republican candidate. Am I right? Yes, sir, democracy is God's best gift. Right after family, of course. And it's good to meet you, too. Feel free to stay in Andale as long as you like. Heck, stop by the house for dinner sometime if you'd like. Just let Linda know beforehand so she can make enough for four. I hope to see you there. So, did you need anything else? Come back anytime. Glorious day. Well, hello. Welcome to Andale, winner of the best town in the USA contest. Well, I don't right know. But we're the best one. Isn't that what matters? I mean, we're the winners. Us. Not Springfield. Not Rockville. Us. So like I was saying, welcome to Andale. What can the Smith family do for you? Really, don't be such a stranger. You're new here, aren't you? Wow. I've never got a chance to talk to the new people. Dad always takes care of them before I get a chance. What? It's okay, I guess. There aren't a lot of kids around here. And no one who comes to visit stays around long. Dad says it could be worse. But there are a lot of starving kids in other places. But still, I wish I had more kids to play with. The same things that all parents do. My mom cooks and cleans the house, and my dad goes to work with Mr. Wilson. They work in the basement, or sometimes in Mr. Wilson's shed. Dad says that when I'm older, I'll come to work with him and learn the family business. Gosh, I wish I could go with you. Okay. Jesus, man. Well, hi there. Welcome to Andale. I'm Willie Wilson, though folks just call me Bill. Is there anything I can do for you? 
We'll catch you later. Why, hello there. I heard there was someone new coming. How can our little family help you? Are you joking? It's fantastic here. The best town in the USA. Has been for why it's been so many years running that I've lost count. We'll see. Not supposed to talk to strangers. Old man Harris. What? How? How did you get in here? What are you doing in this town? Get out! Get out while you can! What's wrong? You don't see anything wrong with a quiet little town full of friendly people in the middle of a blasted wasteland? No. Well, yes. But it's all a trick! Don't you know anything? Did you just crawl out of a vault or something? <laughs> just about everyone in the wasteland knows to avoid Andale, and they're right to do it. People wander in here, and they don't wander back out. You should. Otherwise, you'll end up just like the rest. What? You don't believe me? Just look in the basements. Or out in the shed. You'll see what I mean. Get out! Get out while you can! Day, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. <laughs> I'm sorry, we're just not gonna do that. I already know what it is. So they are cannibals. They just eat other- they, they kill other people and eat other people. That's what they do. So... And we got a scorpion. And... Slice, slice. I'm loving this deathclaw gauntlet. It's good against, like, mutants as well. I just- when it's against- against- when it's against a deathclaw, it's not very effective. So, gotta figure out a new one for that. Ooh, what do we got here? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I hoping that they'd be that, that that mass explosion will kill half of them. Okay, we need some more.
you know, this would look so, oh god, this would look so awesome and cool and everything like that, if it, if there was like water, like a lake to look at, not just that. There's something red down below me, somewhere. Oh well. It would be amazing if I could get past you. I'm sorry, but it's a good little boy playing tough man and I slice him in half. Gee, I wonder where they could be hiding. Hmm, let's follow the path and find out. I feel like my I feel like my game is about to crash. It just it, it keeps stuttering and the stutters are getting a bit bigger, so I feel like it's about to crash. So I have Animal Friend. Animal Friend 
is a perk where animals do not attack me unless I attack them first. So I can literally walk past all these Yao Gals and they will not attack me or my companion. Well, they shouldn't. That's, that's pretty much what the mod does. But I guess we'll just wait and see. There we go. schematic for a okay. I'm not walking all the way around just to get out jeez fuck that man I don't know how I missed that the first time God, I feel like my game is just about to crash. Time to die. <laughs> Maybe it is this mod. Maybe I should take off this mod.
Yeah, I think, uh, yeah, I think it's the mod. I think it's the mod that I need to raise. The problem is, I don't know if... if I think I need to erase the mod. So I have a mod called Fallout 3 Rebirth, and it's just meant to put more. Maybe I actually. Maybe I need to actually. Maybe I just need to fix the memory. Go into the hard files and fix the memory. Expand Fallout 3's memory base so it's not struggling. I'm only getting 40 frames right now, which is fucking stupid. My computer can play Battlefield and only lose 20 frames and it shows 200 frames, so... Kingslayer, how are you? You're not gonna like me very soon. I'm about to end the stream in about 20 minutes, maybe. Head down, idiot. Raider incoming. Oh, okay. If you're going to get yourself killed out here, you mind doing it further away from our bunker? I don't want your corpse sticking up our little patch of heaven. Yeah, that's what they all say, usually just before stepping on a landmine. I'm Defender Anne-Marie Morgan with the Outcasts. Steer clear of here and you should be able to continue with that whole not dying plan. We call ourselves the Outcasts, and we collect technology to preserve it from tribals and idiot locals. And before you ask, we were cast out from that company of Zeros, who call themselves Lion's Brotherhood of Steel. The way we figure it, if traders think we're too harsh in following orders, we're probably doing something right. 
We aren't recruiting, kid. Old sap lions might trust walk-ins, but we don't. But if you want to help out, well, we might be able to work out a deal. You bring in technological devices, and we'll pay you a finder's fee based on the device. But Protector Kasdan would have to okay it first. Okay, but first you'll have to talk with Protector Kasdan. You can work out the details with him. Protector Kasdan, sir! I'm Protector Henry Kasdan, leader of the Outcasts. This had better be good. Normally, I wouldn't be wasting my time talking to a local, but Morgan tells me you can make yourself useful. So, interested in collecting technology for us? It's simple enough. Bring in technological devices, and we'll pay you for what you find. Big things like power armor or energy weapons are best, but we'll take things like sensor units or spare parts, too. You never know what's important. In return, we'll pay you with your choice of 556 ammo, grenades, stim packs, or right away. I'll bet they're more useful to you out there anyway. That's what I like to hear. You can start immediately. You'll report directly to me. I'll take in your gear and dole out your pay. Now get cracking. I see you've got some of our power armor there. I'll just take that off your hands. I'm sure you just found it in the wastes and you're returning it to us, right? Because you'd have to be a real moron to try to turn it in for pay. Now, let's see what else you've got. God damn it, motherfuckers. Well, I'll be damned. The Advanced Power Armor Mark II. This is superb. Absolutely superb. Now. What can I give you in return? Oh, what do we reckon? Let's go that one. Here's hoping you don't have to use it, but who am I kidding? We can always use them. Now, here you go. This is some pretty heavy-duty stuff. And... Here you... Oh. Uh... What haven't... Oh, I haven't... I haven't been here. So, tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen, in our stream, we'll be doing all this tomorrow, and then... We'll go, we'll be doing all this, and then we'll be going in all here. So, we, we're, we're close to finishing. Anyways, that's going to be it from me today, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, if you want to follow me in the social medias, there are links in the description. Other than that, I will see you.